Hey guys! Well, this was unexpected. Uh, I thought all of the episodes that had been recorded on Place TV of Minecraft were of Owen and I, but it turns out I actually recorded three s solo episodes as well. I don't know how that happened. Um, so, <laughs> it looks like I've uploaded every single episode of the lost episodes of Owen and I, and now the next three episodes, over the next three days, what you're about to see is the three solo episodes that I did. Um, so these will be the lost episodes of my solo series, and uh, hopefully you will enjoy. Hello, animal lovers and gamers everywhere. My name is Mega Animal Doctor, and welcome to my first solo episode of Minecraft Survival Mode. Now, we will be playing in a world that I am titling Old World. I do this a lot. I delete my worlds after a while, um, and then just make my world New World, and then I make my next world Old Worlds. You know, it's when I have multiple wor worlds. If that made any sense, I'm glad. If that did not make any sense, I'm really sorry about that. But anyway, no... If you guys are wondering, by the way, I worded that, no, I did not delete Owen's world. Uh, that's still there for the next time he comes over. Hopefully we can do more Minecraft after that. But in the meantime, let's do this. Oh, and also, unlike multiplayer, first off, I don't use cheats. That's, no, I'm not using cheats. Second off, I usually delete my worlds if I die once. I treat them like a hardcore mode, uh, only I... It's a survival mode, not a hardcore mode. I just delete them after I die because it's really a pain in the butt recovering from dying. So um, just bear with me on that if I end up having to delete my world because I die. So in the meantime, look at this. This is a nice little field. I always like spawning in nice fields because that means there are most likely sh some sheep nearby. So let's see. I think I'm seeing a treeless grove over there. Ooh, it's a little cave area. Ow. <laughs> that was stupid of me. Probably shouldn't have done that. Oh. I guess I didn't see any treeless groves. I see some pigs. Hey there, guys. Um, I'm going to call you Bob, Steve, and Mark. I, I don't know why I came up with those names. I just did. I, I, I just kind of did. Now, <laughs> I am not a professional game commentary person by any stretch of the imagination. This is... One of my first times doing solo commentary, the only other time I've done solo commentary actually recording, is Abzu, which you guys um, may have seen by now. If you haven't, then maybe go see it? I don't know. The problem is Abzu, like I said, stated in my Abzu video, ooh, a cool swamp. My problem with Abzu is, like a lot of other high-quality games, where... It won't run on my computer in the high quality graphics. So either I have high quality graphics and constant lag that just completely that is just completely unhelpful to my situation and just makes it harder to play the game, or I tone down the graphics in order to enjoy less lag. It, it sucks and I really hate it. And I don't understand how Markiplier and Jacksepticeye and all those other people are able to keep such a high-quality computer with them. It, it's just an, a never-ending mystery. I have a feeling it's probably because they have a newer model, but I have absolutely no idea. It just, it, so you'll have to bear with me on some of those higher-quality games where I'll have to tone down the graphics because my computer can't handle them. And I'm really sorry about that in advance when a game like that happens. But it just, it, it's just inevitable. And also, just so you guys know, like I said in my previous Minecraft videos, I do keep the sound off while I'm playing Minecraft because I tend to listen to YouTube or Netflix or something else while I'm doing Minecraft. It's just a thing of mine. So the sound is not on. If you like the sound, I apologize. But it's just a thing of mine. So hopefully you can deal with it. Also, I know this is tedious for me collecting all of these mushrooms, but it's important for me because you never know when another red mush... because here's my tip. I always make mushroom soup whenever I find um, both kinds of mushrooms 
and the red ones are so hard to find. And I've learned that if you find a bunch of red ones and you don't have any of these ones, you're going to be really sorry about it. So I just collect every mushroom I see now. Uh, and it might be a bit tedious. You know what? Just for the sake of this video, I'm not going to collect any more mushrooms because I'm in the area anyway. So I might as well just start killing some sheep. Let's see. Um, I, I see... I like to keep some sheep around so that I can farm them. Um, is there enough? Yeah, yeah, there should be enough. I can kill all three of these sheep here and then keep those four alive, two whites and two grays, so then I can have them in my, in my farm. Oh, is that gray or is that white? It looks gray, especially when compared to this guy. Oh, well, let's just uh, get these guys. <laughs> I wonder if there are any people in the comments that are just like, why don't you just wait to mine iron and use shears? It's just easier doing this, and besides, I get mutton out of it. So, it's useful to do this. Hmm, should I live on the mountain or in the swamp? I have a feeling I should live on the mountain and then come back down every now and again just to collect materials from the swamp. That's what I'm feeling I should do. Uh, if you can just... just I need to... Kill you! Don't run away from me! There you go. Thank you. Uh, wait, have I only killed... Oh, okay. I was like, wait, did I only kill two sheep? How did that happen? Yeah, no. Um, let's get some wood, finally. Um, da -da -dum -da -dum 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 -dum. Chopping down some wood. Chopping down some wood. Chopping down some wood. Oh, man. I remember when I first got Minecraft, it was one or two years ago, I was really annoyed by the hype of it all. I was, like, refusing to play the game for a long time. And then finally, one day, it was just like, okay, this game seems like too much fun. I really want this game. So, we, we ended up getting the game, and I'm so glad we did, because it's, it's addicting, is the main problem. It's, I have a feeling there are probably a lot of people out there who are like, and yeah, Minecraft is old school by now, but it's still fun for me. And there's also proof out there that the world of Minecraft is not dying anytime soon, because Minecraft has released its new subscription box, Mine Chest, which... It's a bit on the expensive side, to be honest, but, I mean, at least it's not as expensive as the Curiosity box that Vsauce just released. That thing is really expensive even though it's only it it's a quarterly box unlike Minecraft which I think is a monthly box so maybe overall maybe the curiosity box might be cheaper but I, I don't know but it just shows that Minecraft is still alive and there are still a ton of fans out there in Minecraft it's it's just awesome and sometime I should do a video uh, with my friend Jack because we we have a lot of fun when we play Minecraft, and I've actually been on his channel as well. Um, I will link both of his channels in the description below, and you guys can see me. There was one time when we were doing a live stream, and I didn't realize the live stream would be delayed by a couple of seconds, and so I was hearing my own voice and not recognizing my own voice, and being like, "Who's that? Who who else do you have on this on this conversation?" Oh wait. That's me. I finally realized it after I realized that the guy was saying the exact same things that I was saying. So, that shows how much of an idiot I can be sometimes. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Okay, that's how I usually build my houses. That's the formula I usually build my houses in. Okay, so doing this, doing this, and sorry if you hear noises in the background. That's my mom and dad doing stuff. Um, yeah, so, anyway, I've got a bed here. Did I get any? No, I didn't get any saplings. I should probably get some saplings and then move them on up here so that I can actually, so that I don't have to get go down to the swamp to get trees, you know? It's going to be annoying after a while if I have to keep going down to the swamp to get trees. It's going to be annoying, or to get wood. That's going to be really annoying if I have to keep doing that. Uh, no, didn't mean to do that. I pressed E by mistake. Um, yeah. 
Yeah. So let me let me ask you guys, because I'm kind of curious about something. What controls do you guys like in Minecraft? Because I know that there are a lot of people out there who use quite different controls from the default ones. Um, what do I want to do? Uh, they use different keys to place stuff. Um, they use auto jump. You know, they 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 do stuff like that, and it. It's just not the way I'm used to playing it. So let me know. It's not the question of the day, but let me know down in the comments below um, what controls you use for your Minecraft game, because I'm actually kind of curious. Um, so yeah, let's just get some more wood here. It'd be nice if I'd be able to find a zombie, because sometimes they have carrots, and if they have carrots, then that means I can start a carrot farm, which means I can herd some pigs over. But I can I, I hardly ever find zombies with carrots. That's it's very rare for me. Um, so. All right, so let's keep going here. Keep building our house. If I can just get up there. <laughs> if I can just jump up there properly. I'm just building a house. If I can just place the darn bricks, the darn blocks, whatever the heck they are, um, that'd be awesome. All right, is it coming close to nighttime? I think it's getting kind of close to nighttime. I'll get another tree, um, and I'll plant these saplings, and then I'll be on my way over to bed. Let's just see. Um, might as well collect some seeds while I'm here. It's just a bunch of grass. <laughs> um. <laughs> ah, boy. I'm sorry, guys. I'm just completely blanking right now in terms of coming up with smart commentary. Ugh. It's a challenge for me sometimes. Um, what else can I talk about here? I'll ask a question here. When did you guys start Minecraft? Like, what, what was your first um, time playing Minecraft? Like, your first time with your own copy, or your first time playing someone else's copy? Something like that. What was your first experience with Minecraft? I'd be very curious to know. Because I bet for most of you guys now, if you've played Minecraft, you've probably been heckled by your friends to play Minecraft. I have a good feeling. Uh, but that could just be me. I just realized that that was one of the saplings I planted earlier. I didn't realize it would grow that fast. Wow. Alright then. Let's go to bed. First night done. And I'm making at least a little bit of progress. And then the door will be through here. I know what you guys are screaming at me in the comments, so you should get an axe. Don't worry. I'm going to get that in just a second. Dun, dun, dun. Yeah, this is the trick that Owen showed me how to do in terms of mining. I never used to do this until we played Minecraft for the first time together and then he showed me how to do this, and I was like, you know, that's probably a smart idea if I want to get materials. <laughs> I was really bad at Minecraft back in the day, but now I've at least gotten better. Oh, that's gravel. I shouldn't be using a pickaxe. Oh, pardon me. I shouldn't be using a pickaxe on gravel. That's just a waste of good, a perfectly good pickaxe, even if it's wooden. Just mining gravel. It's annoying how it falls the way it does. Yeah. It gets dark in here is the problem. I need I need charcoal or coal or something so that I can make torches. Alright. Oh, should I and eh, nah, I have plenty. <laughs> I have plenty of materials for both a wooden pickaxe or a stone pickaxe and a stone axe. So 
I'll be fine. Um, da -dum -da -dum, chopping down this tree. I hate the big trees. I, 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 most people may love the big trees because it means a lot of wood. But I, I, I just find them annoying because it takes forever to chop them down. That's just my personal opinion, anyway. Not making two furnaces. I don't usually make two furnaces. That's not usually what I do. Okay. I'll get another tree later for now. I'm just gonna plant this here. Oh! I think a zombie died outside my house. I think I just see saw zombie flesh. Yep, that's zombie flesh. Hold on. Uh, oh, ow. Nom, 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 nom. Oh, food poisoning. I always do that. Just because, <laughs> even you know, food poisoning doesn't ultimately harm me. It just doesn't really give me any more health unless I'm at like the, you know, like the one and a, one hunger point, you know. Um, but I, I just always do it anyway, so. I hope my style of Minecraft isn't particularly annoying to you Minecraft players because it's just how I've grown accustomed to playing the game. <laughs> um, so for those of you guys who don't particularly like my my playing style, sorry, it's my own, just bear with me. Or if you really don't like it, then that's not my problem. So, alright, get, oh, I have an axe. I don't need my hand, I have an axe. It's weird not having someone else to talk to. I mean, it, it's nice always having it's nice having Owen around to do these let's plays. It's a lot it's a lot of fun doing them with Owen. It, a ton of fun. When <laughs> I mean, even before we started actually recording us playing the worlds, we would just have a ton of fun on Minecraft. Unlike Jack, who would constantly troll me throughout the entirety of our gaming session. Owen and I would always just work together, and it was really nice, because Owen wasn't trying to kill me 24-7, so that was really nice. Oh, uh, God. Yeah, and it, it's always fun playing with Owen. It'll be a lot of fun when I when I get around to doing my next episode of, um, of Let's Play Multiplayer Minecraft with him, because, God, those first six episodes were fun. We just... That was that was what we did the entire time we hung out. We just recorded those Minecraft videos, and it was tons and tons of fun. I'm really excited to do it again. Also, I just saw coal. It's right over here. I can now mine it and create torches and cook my mutton if there's an odd amount of coal. Because I like having even amounts of coal. If I don't have even amounts of coal, it bugs the heck out of me. <laughs> I don't know why. It just has always bugged me. So. Mining the coal and getting supplies. Alright. Glad I found coal on the surface. This is good. It means that I don't have to go mining way down my shaft mine for more coal. I always hate it when you have to do that. Like, have you ever had those experiences where you're just mining down or you're just mining through some place and you just you can't find any coal and so it's just darkness all around you? Oh god, I hate that. I always love it when there's coal close to the surface or on the surface or something like that. Is the tree Is there another piece of wood in there? Yes, there is. Hold on one second. I'm going to get that. There we go. Now hopefully it dies. If it doesn't die, then we'll know that there's yet another piece in there. And then, dum, dum. Uh, okay. And I'll start building my roof. This is how I usually build my houses. So. Ah, oh, dang it. Didn't mean to place that there. <laughs> didn't mean to place that there. Alright. Um, yeah, I think that's all the wood in there. So, that one's good. Wait. Oh, I thought it... Is that... Is that sugar cane or is that just grass? I can't tell from here. Also, yes, I know my hunger is low. I'll get that in just a second. Um, you know what? I got nothing better to do. At this point, I'm just going to head back home and 
eat my mutton. That's just what I'm going to do. And hope that that oak tree spawns an apple. Because what I wouldn't give for a quick apple snack. That's probably the quickest I've ever eaten my first supply of mutton. This is not good. <laughs> this is not going to end well. Oh, God. Whenever I think of Minecraft and I look at this massive world and the fact it's in 3D, 3D space and that people have calculated that it would be bigger than our entire Earth if it were actually real, when I think about that, I just I can't imagine how much work the programmers must have gone through to create this game. It's so well done. It's, it's amazing. And I mean, fine, the graphics aren't realistic, but I think the pixel art style is perfect for this kind of game. But then again, Minecraft did become famous, and these graphics have kind of cemented itself with this game, so I suppose I can't really criticize the graphics for that. Again, I have an axe. What am I using my hand for? I, I, you guys are probably screaming at the comments, use your axe. I don't know why I'm not using my axe. Usually I'm pretty good at using it, but I guess not as much right now. All right, I have enough wood to go. Ooh, saplings. I have enough wood to build the rest of my roof, so let's do that. Ugh. Oh, another one of my trees has grown. That would have been good to know before I left. <laughs> I don't know if it grew while I was gone or when I left or when it grew, but it would have been nice to know that that tree had grown when I left. Ah, <laughs> oh, dang it. Ah, oh, come on. Why do I keep doing that? I keep placing the blocks of wood in the wrong places. Hold on. And boom. And that's done. Alright. And I usually create sticks and then make a shovel. And then I can do that. And then that. And then that. Alright. And now my house can be lit up. It's nice. It has a cabinistic feel to it. It has a sort of log cabin-ish feel to it. It's nice. Alright, collecting more seeds. I might as well try to make a hoe. Um, so otherwise, how am I going to plant my seeds? Um, Let's see. I need more dirt, is my thing. I'm gonna mine some. Oh, I have a shovel. <laughs> I'm forgetting to use my tools all over today. Like, seriously. It's sad. <laughs> I'm not using my shovel. I'm not using my axe. What am I doing? Alright. Alright. Um. That's good enough. I usually place my seeds in columns of three because um, it just it, it feels organized that way. So I need to find one more seed. And it's almost nighttime. I was planning on ending this episode at the set at the end of the second Minecraft day. So this will be near the end of the episode. Once I find the seed, I'll get to bed and then figure out a question of the day. Um, Oh, I don't have a hoe. So, let's create one. And then... I'll create two, actually. I mean, might as well. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Well, actually, that's a better idea. <laughs> that's a better idea. Um, okay, just really quick, I'm going to go out here and hope that no monsters spawn on me. God, that first night though, from with Owen and I, if you guys haven't seen it, it, it we just failed. We we epically failed at, <laughs> that first night, or at least I did. Uh, he didn't, but I sure did. 
that was not fun. And I'll put this stuff in my chest, mushrooms, okay. And I'll put one of my swords in there, okay. And there we go, and that's the end of the second day, and the beginning of the third day. So, that about does it for me here. I hope you guys enjoyed my first episode of Solo Minecraft. If you guys haven't seen my multiplayer Minecraft, first of all, check that out. It's awesome. It's with my friend Owen, and it, it was just so fun. Second off, if you guys haven't seen it, this is what my skin looks like. I understand it looks a little weird, but I created it off of one of those amateur skin creator apps. So, it's it's nice for what it is, and it, it's just, it's it's the skin that I like. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this my first Minecraft episode. Question of the day for you guys. What is the highest level of Minecraft you have ever gone up to? Right now, as you can see on the bottom, I'm at level 2 and about half. Uh, what is the highest level you've ever gotten on a Minecraft game? Let me know down in the comments below. If you enjoyed this episode, consider giving it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more awesome gaming content like this. And as always, I will see you guys next time. Have a great rest of your day! Alright.